So you guys were one. I'm hearing all you guys. You guys wanted the theme song shortened, so here we go. This girl reviews movies, games, and books. Sometimes she plays them. So does that. And when she does it with the cat, does that make her crazy? Does that make her crazy? Probably. <laughs> so, it's shorter. There you go. <laughs> Crazy Cat Lady or Martha Butler does not own the any trailers or pictures. I use them under fair use. Educational for education and entertainment purpose. Uh. Hi everybody, Martha here. So today we're doing... I went and saw Chong Chi yesterday. If I'm saying it right, <laughs> but it was um it was okay. Finally got to the theater and watched it. Is it should you wait into the 45 days to watch it? If you're able to go and see it, go see it. If your theaters are not closed in your area, go see it. If you're feeling up to go and see it. Go see it. <laughs> Um, so, if you, if you're, like, a newbie is, as much as I am about Chong Chi, like, I didn't know, I don't really much read much comics. Sorry, um, eh, this, I'm a new cat, I'm gonna probably get rid of him, like, once he gets a new home or whatever, but... He is really, really hyper right now. Anyway, so this movie is um, about a guy named Sean. She, he, he calls himself Sean. And when he's hiding out um, from his dad in San Francisco, and you don't use they even joke about in the movie that you should not that you, when you are hiding you don't use a name that sounds very close to your name. Okay, I think he's gone. Um. Anyway. Uh. So, at the beginning of the movie, we do have a little flashback of, between um, his mom and his dad. His dad's Mandarin. And I'm not very good at saying um, Chinese names, so I probably won't. I was probably calling them by um, either say mom or dad. Or say their si or probably say sister. I don't know. I'll try. Saying their, we're saying their name, but basically his dad was like has been been around for like a thousand years. I guess the rings make you live longer than usual. They don't really that to me they they didn't explain him why he could live as long as he's have, and he's like going around conquering um cities in um China and um to get stronger and stuff like that. They don't really explain to you how he came across the rings, or the origins of the rings, like where they came from, um, during this movie. Um, so eventually he ends up going, um, coming across the town after he, um, that is, like, in another, um, realm, and, or dimension, or whatever, and he meets, um... Sean's mom, and she's the only, she's like one of the few people that can beat him still, because of her. It's like ha, she's able to like control the wind and stuff like that. And when they fight, it's like um like they're dancing. It looks like, and so he falls in love to her because he's the only one person that could beat him. And 
for the time being that they're together. He doesn't use the Ten Rings, and sadly she dies, and he goes right back to being what he who he was before. And she's telling that, and her mo his mom's telling this to um a younger version of um of Sean, and then we like cut to the present, and we know this is the same guy, it's the same kid. Well, grown because he has like a little um pendant that his mom gave him, and these pendants are important because even his sister has the same as a, a similar one. It like shows a map. It shows a map to where um how to get, how to get back to her village. Would you stop it? I might end up putting him back outside. Uh, anyway, um, they end up going, she, um, he works at, he's a chauffeur at a hotel, and him and his friend, um, Katie, who's played by Aquafina, um, and both, um, like, drive fancy cars, and for a living and get paid and um at nighttime they do karaoke too um like the Eagles song <laughs> um um living in a hotel in California <laughs> and um they like, talk to their friends and stuff like that like in, like in the other regular life about stuff and the next day basically they're both on the bus to go to work and I do like during this movie that no, like there's like no hint that these two probably would end up like being um boyfriend and girlfriend. They keep it um they're just friends. Like they hug during this movie. They don't they never go up to they never go up to kiss scene. It's nice to have like at least one relationship where and 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 um in Marvel were they're one of her sent friends for that whole out the whole entire movie. She's not just a lover interest, she's just his friend. <laughs> so the like, only hint that, that they might get together is, is um her grandma asking um saying in Chinese, Why don't you cheat and they get together? <laughs> and um Sean just Sean saying back to him, We're just friends. Um So they end up finding they end up getting enough into a fight by um some of um his dad's f fighters in order to get the pendant and um Katie like does uh, um doesn't believe that anything could happen to and like he doesn't know fighting but John surprises her and like does a bunch of fighting moves during this and you did see you did see most of this in the trailers a lot of us in the trailers, but there is some parts that's missed out. Um, and sadly, we end up like having the gas break out, and I think um the um, the bus driver gets hit. I don't, we don't know if he's okay or not. So um they have to, um Katie has to drive the bus, and um it's one of those buses that it's like that has like two um carts, and um so part of it's cut almost gets cut off and they had to do like a really sharp turn to get rid of it and then have all the guys in the in the other um cart and make the, all the passengers get to it. and somebody's filming it of course and they had to like use a tr a dumpster tr um dumpster um truck and a bunch of other cars that were under like, like they drew over a bunch of cars hopefully these guys have insurance and in order to slow it down, so and the fighting moves, the fighting's a lot better and than anything that we saw in um <sighs> and then um then Iron Fist. And yep, this this movie just makes Iron Fist looks worse. If you've seen that show. 
but so they end up like going they end up like having to figure out what's going on and they f um after the pendant's gone they um he knows that his sister is going to end up getting captured uh how can go you know, after two and he apparently she he thinks that um she sent him a letter in the mail to go, like where the address is where she's at and so he goes there and um, Katie goes with him even though she tells him stay here and she ex and he also explains to him that Sean's his name is Sean Chi and she makes a jokes about you used the worst cover up name no wonder your dad found you um and but he did it when he was 15 so it's when he, 15 or 14 when he ran out in a way you have uh Okay, I'm gonna. P can't do this while. Would you calm down? I'm gonna have to pop. Hold on. Uh, I had to put it back outside. It wasn't head fleas, and I don't want it to infect my other cat. Nah, <sighs> uh, so anyway, I had too much a big heart, really. Let's go back to the movie. I won't be letting him back in now since I saw the it's fleas. But okay, where were we? Um, so you find out his sister, um, like runs like a underground fighting arena, and she has like a bunch of like other superpower characters, and we also see uh Wong in the. Abomination, who looks different in this movie, <laughs> and then he did the other one, and they are, but he um Wong ends up winning by um using the rings against him, by making him punch him, by making the Abomination punch him, making him punch himself through the the rings in the head. And he ends up taking, I think he ends up taking him back to his, um, cell. And, I don't know if I'm going to talk, like, uh, talk, uh, talk about the whole entire movie. But, it's a really great, mo really great movie, because, um, I don't want to make this be a, a long, a long upload for me. But, there's a lot, the fighting's really good, there's a lot of dragons in it. And a lot of like physical creatures that the only thing I know is that um, I don't know their names, but a lot I know like a lot of them is what some Pokemon are based off of, um, and a lot of cool weapons that exist in real life. You really do need to see it. We they reference like other stuff, other anime stuff, like. The ref um, they he ends up doing a move like from Dragon Ball Z, the go the Kamehameha wave. <laughs> later on in the, um, in the movie. So that's pretty cool. And they get to ride on a dragon. <laughs> so it looks a lot like Shinra. So... Basically his his dad... I don't really count the dad as a bad guy in this. He, as he's doing something that he probably shouldn't. Like... One, um, he wants to get his wife back after she died. She was killed by like a rival gang, and she was and, and um, Arna, like Arna teach him a lesson, and that's why she trained. He trained um, Sean, not his sister. His sister had to learn all by herself since she he, since he she was a girl. And he ends up leaving. She gets sent off to kill like the main guy um, that killed her dad. Killed her. Uh, killed his mom when he's like fourteen. And um, he never comes back after it. He like tells um Katie that he didn't do it, and later on he tells her that he did. And he 
Manly did it humanly was ashamed of it. So he never wanted to go back to it, which I don't blame him. And the reason why he the dad's mainly um doing what he's doing, he thinks he's hearing um his wife's voice, but it's really um an evil of shell character that is like making him that it's talking to him using his wife's voice um about this and making him and one attempt to un, un, uh, release it and we kind of have a little um iron man 3 moment here um if you guys remember trevor the one that pretended to be the mandarin that um he's in this he's like he um the if you remember them old um one shot movies and like um they had like at the beginning of phase one or or during they um like during like the olden days they don't longer do these anymore but that um he was taken from jail and um the ten rings were gonna execute him but they thought they thought he was funny so he became a court jester. <laughs> And so he does help out during this. He's just not there for a cameo. He actually helps out during this. He helps, like, he can, because he can understand, like, a mythical creature that um, has gotten to their, um, they came there and they're going to fight finding a way to get back home before um, the gate opens. Because, it, 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 like, my using went, like, ways to go. Stuff like that. And. Um, they end the um they end up like getting back to the the magical world, and this is where they meet um their mom, his mom's sister, and she explains to him, nope, it's not when his mom's listening to some evil creature that wants to that the Tim Rays can use to let out. So. Yeah, but they the guy gets his dad gets there. He also, he also learns how to be his dad, learning like the moves that his mom has used. Um, Katie gets end up learning how to use the bow and arrow. Um, and even though she's only been using it for one day, she's pretty good at it. Um, and his sister gets to have um her weapon, one of her weapons that she's using um the um, in there. And so they all fight, um, and when the fight's really good, you really need to. It's hard to describe it. It's better to just watch it. Just describing would just um, cheapen it, <laughs> or something like that. It's it's you can't say it with words. You had to see it to it, kind of believe it. So um, I'm gonna get this movie um, a ten out of ten. Uh, so I'll see you guys later. Like here and subscribe and bye bye.